whoever loves father or mother more than me, and whoever loves son or daughter more than me, is not worthy of me. And whoever does not take up the cross and follow me is not worthy of me. Verses 37 and 38 in chapter 10 of Matthew lay out a spartan and rigorous road for those who want to be worthy of Jesus. We should not be surprised at these words, because it is the road that he himself followed. Very few among us can match this challenge, but we should not be discouraged, because we know that Christ died for all of us, not just those who meet the highest standards. For centuries, those who have received Holy Communion have said silently the Latin words non sum dignus, or their English equivalent, I am not worthy. These words acknowledge that we have not met the highest standards for followers of Jesus, but that nevertheless we humbly participate in the Holy Meal. On October 29, we remember a group who did meet the highest standards that Christ has set. On this day in 1885, Bishop James Hannington and his companions were martyred at Bugosa, Uganda. Hannington was the first Anglican bishop of East Equatorial Africa. He and his companions had left their homeland and families in order to bring the gospel to a different part of the world. By doing this, and by ultimately sacrificing their lives, they have earned the right to be remembered as worthy followers of Jesus in the fullest sense of the word.